I'm Augusta Serapinas. I'm from Vilnius. I did uh, site-specific work here. So what I did, I opened the space. This is like, I, I took out the bricks and the, this fake wall. The space is 17 meters long and 15 meters high. And it's in between two walls. People who even worked in Mukas, they didn't know about the space. So there was a stairs and I climbed here and I took this wall, I destroyed this wall from inside and, uh, and I cut at first a small hole there <laughs> and put my head <laughs> like where I am. <laughs> then I just cut and this almost literally like just breaks into the museum. I changed some things inside because of the health and safety requirements. Basically, I see these actions as a dialogue because uh, the museum, like every institution, have uh, specific requirements and, for example, this lead is supposed to be covered. And then I'm just looking for the best solution, how I can do it, so keep it and still keep it visible. And then those actions are becomes part of my uh, war. It becomes as an ins installation. Only from here you can just see that there is a room or something. Probably. <laughs> At least you have a possibility. I found some maps and uh, some plans of the of the this area around the Muka which had never been realized. And here I have some maps and some old photos. So now we are in this uh, secret room which usually which visitors can't approach and uh, this room is uh, for the research of the of the place around the Muka. This is how it looked. You see the same building or or this and those are never been realized. It was realized this one. Yeah, I, I, I tried to sit there and kind of <laughs> looked at the maps at some point. And I left everything as a room for, for someone to, to come and actually to continue this, let's say, research. And it's kind of a very probably different atmosphere here. You don't feel like you are in exhibition, probably. But on the same time, it's very important to understand that this is this, the part of the building, the part of the museum. Uh, for me, this hiding thing or this kind of sneaking around, it always relates, at first, not for the space itself, but from the people or from the sort of action which is behind it. I'm always trying to mention it.